good morning i am talking on numbers in daily life tedx jsb x english alphabet used as a mathematical symbol today speaks with us x is equal to independently organized ted event so mathematics is always in our daily life a person reads a news in a paper regarding the petrol price hike news says petrol price hike hike is rupees 5 per liter at least at that moment the individual may think let me use my four wheeler here after for specific purposes and for all my personal purposes let me use my two wheeler even in the organization the transport in charge logistics in charge may think about the transportation cost price is a number in terms of money petrol consumption requirement of the individual organizations backed up by the purchasing power it is the demand price and demand relating to these individuals have to take a decision so numbers are always in our daily life people think mathematics is pure numbers though it is so it is much more than that it has its own applications in our day to day life in business as i pointed out demand and price play the role in terms of numbers mathematics has its own applications in engineering the graph theory number theory number theory in discrete mathematics communication engineering finding the rate of change are all the applications of mathematics in our day to day life in any field of science solution we find the knowledge is the solution on the research peter drucker says if you don't measure you cannot improve aristotle says mathematics is the science of quantity and engineering to contrive to devise newton searched solution to a problem why whatever is thrown up comes down to earth the uh, knowledge resultant knowledge was gravity law of gravity so mathematics has its role in everyday life mathemat peter drucker as he said if you don't measure you cannot improve measure indicates data data can be manipulated to get information through information knowledge can be gained any real life problem specifically in business and economics in decision making situations can be formulated into a mathematical model solution can be obtained the solution can be valued by the domain experts let the data be on price and demand with the help of simple mathematical concept curve fitting the demand law can be given in the form of a linear equation x is equal to a minus bp x denotes demand p denotes price again it can be extended by applying the differentiation concept to get the elasticity of demand the number elasticity of demand when it is valued by the domain professionals in business and economics discussion on price de determination will take 
and it will end in a success in price fixation these are the few examples how mathematics is used in our day to day academic as well as in the real life that is why mathematics is given as a subject along with the specialized subject in ug and pg classes in the college days even in certain universities mathematics is given as a specialized subject because its application helps to solve several problems in specialized subject not only in specialized subject in the real life also but in recent days a great decline is find in learning mathematics even those who are taking mathematics as a special subject at some times in their profession and real life fail to solve some problems this is because lack of fundamental fundamental knowledge in mathematics it is true because of the current examination pattern which focuses on scoring marks fundamentals are not taught properly it is true in lower classes higher level mathematics is taught this skipping fundamentals in the lower classes give its effects in future when real life problems are solved mathematics was very simply handled by our poets and saints in tamil literature in 18th century andal the only female alwar in her tirupavai in a stanza she prays almighty like talade saarangam udaitha saramulai pol vaala ulaginil peidirai naangalum it goes vaala ulaginil peidirai naangalum inda ulagil makkal magilchiyaga vaalum alavirkku mattume migayum illamal kuraiyum illamal alavudan peididuga she prays almighty to shower rain enough up to the level people can live happily up to the extent to live happily is a limit to the rainfall limit is a very basic mathematical analysis concept again when the importance of tirupavai was told by an alwar she handles simple arithmetic beautifully he says i aindum aindum 5 into 5 equal to 25 i aindum aindum plus 5 25 plus 5 30 there are 30 stanzas in tirupavai how wonderfully the simple arithmetic is used in lyrics you see and avvai moodati we know she is known as tamil moodati in her attitude she says yen eluthu igalil the meaning is don't despise numbers and letters don't ignore letters again we have a proverb ennum eluthum kannanathagum numbers and letters are eyes to the human beings if we don't have eyes we know the consequences 200 2000 years before the tamil saint tiruvalluvar has given yen enba yena elut enba ivarendum kann enba vaalum uyirku learning arts and science through numbers and letters lead to a life of fulfillness so that is how the importance of numbers were emphasized by in earlier days by the tamil poets and saints the learned persons they find similarity in the real world nature and mathematics nature is a beautiful combination of life and lifeless in nature 
for every element there is an anti element there are good and bad things putting together this good and bad element and anti element is equal to zero which is the shape of the world in mathematics we have positive numbers for every positive number there is a negative number putting together we get zero which is the shape of the world zero this beautiful number was found by indians in the 3rd century and they used it in their day to day affairs you would have heard about aryabhatta bhaskaracharya the then famous mathematicians now we know about one mr ramanujam the great mathematician who was admired and wondered by the eminent mathematics professors in various universities in all over the world the zero is everything zero is nothing consider the number 0.05 point 0 this zero lives has life consider the number 0.50 here zero doesn't exist it has no meaning lifeless so world is universe nature is the combination of life and lifeless similarity we find in mathematics that is why people say any real life problem can be solved with the help of mathematics those who have studied know about operations research a concept subject which played a very crucial role in the second world war in british army and uh, which is now used in various management problems to solve that is one concept simulation which can be used even to solve problems which cannot be brought into mathematical form so such a mathematics it is a master of all subjects but it is a very good friend and servant to all other subjects today it is a big data era organization says we go for a big data hub data gives more information can be used to get the solutions indian institute of management say we go into the era of continuous learning continuous learning is infinite learning big data at the end of the day in the organization everything anything expe- is expected in terms of numbers recently the famous management guru ram charan has written in his book attackers advantage companies which use strong mathematical algorithms will have a huge competitive edge over the companies which do not use it so data facts and figures play vital role in organizations learning simple fundamental mathematics leading to data analytics will make individuals data analytic analytic specialists professionals data scientists organizations which use data science will have a competitive edge so learning mathematics fundamental mathematics strongly which leads to data analyst professionals will make everyone to look look the real world in a new perspective thank you